Well, an interesting conversation is being had before we turn these mics on. I had no idea. Darren, you don't watch a lot of TV, but apparently you're a fan of Shark Tank. Yeah, I like it. Have you yeah. ever uh, thought of some sort of invention? I had one. What? Yeah, I, I'm embarrassed to tell you. I'm, no, I'm, no. I'm, I went all the way through. And then I never, I never. Okay, so it. can so, you share what it yeah, was? Yeah, it's really stupid. It really. Did, like, did you call that late night at TV? They're like yeah, the invention, invention thing. Yeah, I think I might have. Wheel. This is. I was probably. Uh, let's see, I'm 35, 25. I was probably uh, in my early 20s. Yeah. So. Oh God. Okay, here we go. So you go to the bathroom, mm -hmm. right? <laughs> Don't why you see how I, you're looking at me? I'm just looking at you in your eyes. I'm, I'm a little bit nervous of where it's going to go. Everybody has an invention. Yeah. What's yours? Okay. Don't interrupt him. No, I'm just trying to he make. He has a trump here. What's your invention? Well, I'll tell you mine after you tell me. You show me yours. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you're kinky. Okay. Uh -huh. So here we go. So hotels. Yes. And let's say hotels, motels, whatever you want to say. Go back oh, to the end. Yeah. Go back. <laughs> go back to the '80s. Now, okay. get with me. I'm in the '80s. I'm All in right. the late '80s, and I'm thinking, God, you have to go to the bathroom somewhere that you don't know if it's clean mm -hmm. or dirty. You're staying at these little motels along the way, maybe. Your kids are there. Yeah. They're possibly filthy. Did they get clean? Didn't they? I'm not talking about the Ritz. I'm not talking. Right. I'm talking below average mm -hmm. motel. Or average, you know, just you don't know. I'm following. Okay, so I get this idea. What if I invent a plastic toilet seat? Hear me out. Mm -hmm. That when the house cleaner comes in, they they clip that seat off, put a new one on, it's sealed. So when your family walks in, it's sealed for your protection. And we know sitting on the toilet it doesn't create diseases. Right. But the thought of it's just nasty. Fair I, enough. Right. Yeah. Right. Okay. Can I, so, can I tell you something? Yes, you can. I heard that when Madonna played here last time, she has a toilet seat that her people have to see be installed yeah. in her. Everybody's got their Yeah, thing, and it right? has to yeah. be still wrapped yeah. just like that. Or when your kids were you put napkins on the seat if you're somewhere you don't uh -huh. want to sit down. You know, all that stuff. We've all done it probably. But So I started thinking. So I went to a guy in Chesterfield that was a, um, I'm assuming he was an engineer at some level, but he did plastics. So my idea was a plastic seat that you just pop on. You sell these to Holiday Inn yeah. for $2 a piece, and you make a fortune because they're selling all, all over the country. So then we got down to where instead of the plastic seat, because that got expensive, it would be a plastic ring that goes on there. Mm -hmm. So it, it, the, the, the um, cleaning lady would come in, put a plastic ring on it, new ring, okay. and it would be covered with that, you know, like the when you rip something open, it's sealed mm -hmm. for your protection type yep. thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you'd sit down, it's plastic, and you'd sit there in your family or whatever. You'd feel better. People that had that weirdness, right? Yes. So that was my idea. I get all the way through. We go all the way till he builds me a prototype, right? And it's real thin plastic, so you really can't even feel Tell it. that you're on it. Yeah, but it, it's sealed, so it'll say that. Mm -hmm. And when we went to start getting into injection molding and all this, it got a little out of my price range. <laughs> In the early 20s. And, yeah, and I didn't know where to go, how to find them. It's living, hard. It's hard. And I didn't and have it's anybody. Expensive. It's expensive. He charged me, I think, back then a couple grand just to, in his house, do this, yeah. you know. And looking back, I think, you know, you sell that for, you know, 12 cents to Holiday Inn, mm -hmm. and they just pass on the cost of the room. All of a sudden, you're selling... Yeah. Hundreds of thousands of these to all these hotels. Maybe it's stupid. Maybe not. I think people have a feeling and a phobia, and it's kind of a nice thing, right? Well, I have an RV. I have it's my own bathroom. Yeah, right. I don't go into hotels. So that often. was my idea, and I, I still think it was a weird but decent idea. I yeah, don't know, but I think it's a good it idea. It just never made it. Give me the critique, right. it, Jeff. Yeah, I think that's the, what you're doing. I'll be mm -hmm. one of the sharks. Go ahead. And uh, is this is it disposable? It or is. Did they disposable. take it in the back and no, run no, it no, it's gone. Washer? It's gone. Very, it's gone. very. This guy came up with a, didn't come up with it. Found a very, very thin plastic to just seal the seat, and it would be removed each time. But it's sealed. So when you open, when you get there, you see you got to open You're the open one that's the, opened. You got to open it, and it's already mounted. But you just got to rip the paper off. Like yeah. little cellophane stuff, or whatever you call mm -hmm. it. What else? I don't know. I kind of like the idea of taking the whole seat off and running it through the dishwasher <laughs> and putting uh, it back dishwasher? on. Well, that sounds good. I you do know? not want to eat off a plate that a <laughs> toilet <laughs> has. Maybe we can come up with a toilet seat washer. Oh, you're saying you know? take everyone off every time. Yeah, and just snap a new one on. And then just keep just it Just like the sheets. Them. Okay. You know? That's not a bad idea. Just